Hi everyone, thanks for stopping by and welcome to my channel. Today I have an exciting Dollar Tree haul to share with you. Everything I picked up is brand new. If you ever want to know what is new and what to look out for, then be sure you always check out the Come With Me to the Dollar Tree videos I post throughout the week because those are the videos that you're going to see what is new and what to look out for. I'm pretty good about linking that down below so it's easier for you to find. Also, if you'd like to follow me on Instagram or TikTok, I'll link that down below. So with all that said, let me dive in and let me show you on these amazing items I've been able to find at my Dollar Tree for $1.25. So I'm going to start off with these mirrors. Now I know they've had these in the past, but they only had it in one size. You could either buy it in white or black. And now, well, Right now they just have it in black, but they come in three different sizes. Now you can put these on your wall and scatter them around and do some fun design. You could paint these in a different way. You can make a three tier um, tray if you would like. Um, you can use a vase in between them or whatever you want to use really. And you already have the mirror on there so you can do something like that. Or you can use this small size and use it for wheels if you want to make a like a decorative wagon or something. So always try to think, you know, what else can I use those for instead of just a mirror? So maybe that'll give you an idea. And those were over with all the picture frames and that. And here by Crafter Square, they have this wood frame with a tin board. Now, magnets do stick to this. Um, you can always use a rub-on transfer or you could uh, use some of their galvanized items on there. You can put little messages on there if you choose to. It is very lightweight. You can add a magnet on the back if you wanted to stick it onto your fridge or locker. So I did pick up a couple of those. They also have these letter tiles by Crafter Square. They have it in two different sets. Um, each come with 26 letters, so you'll get one letter each in the alphabet. So if you want to spell out quite a bit of stuff, you better pick up multiple packs. But the first one they have is just the plain brown with the black letters. And then they have it in the black and white. So the white tiles will have the black letters and the black tiles will have the white letters. Some fun stuff you can do with those. You can always add magnets on the back if you choose to. The Dollar Tree does sell magnets, but I think it's cheaper to buy it at a different store like Hobby Lobby or Target and get the, um, the little circle one that you can cut what size you want. And stick those on the back and you can use it on your board so you can use it as like a message board or you can put them on your fridge and these are some of the galvanized items i was talking about they have three different ones so they have this cow and they have a pig and they have the rooster so again, they have the three animals. You can hang these on your wall. You can add messages on those. You can put magnets on the back if you wanted to stick them onto something. So I think those were cute and they're pretty good size too, which I always try to put the size of the stuff down there on the bottom so you just have a better idea. Um, I thought these were really cute. I think these would be even cute for uh, Christmas. So they come in a pack of two and they are so Duck, so I'm gonna go to this set um, again you get two on the rope there and they're in the shape of a tag these are chalkboard so you can write little messages on there and they also have it in the white for the wipe off board now you can add these to gifts you can hang these on your Christmas tree you can separate them if you want you can glue them like that if you want them to stick together and you know have different things on there so they have it in the wipe off board and the chalkboard. And then the ones that I can't get on tangled are just regular square ones. So you can get two black ones or you can get two of the white. Again, these are really cute to make um, 
You can add multiples, you know, make a big a banner in a way. If someone's coming home from the army or uh, a baby shower, a wedding, um, bridal shower or something, you can put little messages on there and make a banner. Thought that would be something maybe cute or you can add pictures onto those. They also had these and they had, a, I think, four different ones in all. You can get it in the black chalkboard or you can just get it in the plain wood. So I went ahead and got the chalkboard one. So I think this a coffee cup or cappuccino cup or hot chocolate cup, whatever you want to call it, was really cute. So that'll be something if you have a uh, cocoa bar or a coffee bar, you can add little things on there. And they have a house. You can always take the rope off. You don't have to keep it on there if you don't want to. And you can, you know, stick it to your wall or whatever. So I did pick up those I thought were cute. And if you watched the Come With Me video when I showed you these, I did do a little display on the um, shelf trying to get an idea on how to use these. So they have it in the, of course, the chalkboard and the whiteboard board in the shape of a house. Now what I did, I'll show you right here. I bought two of each and then I just made a square and you could put a candle in between them, which I don't recommend putting a real candle because I don't think you want to put, you know, a live flame with wood. Um, so you can do different um, tabletop decors or if you're buying your own decorations for a wedding or some kind of party, these might be a good idea to make some cute um, decorative pieces for your tables. They have so many new <laughs> pads of paper by Crown Jewels. They have Bible verses. They have dinosaur ones. They have um, dog ones. So the dog ones that I picked up were these uh, dachshund ones. My daughter has a dachshund. So I went ahead and picked up one of each of these. Now on this one, it says fabulous on each page and the line, the pages are lined. And then on the longer one, they have just polka dots on there. And my other daughter, she has two corgis. If I still have a picture, I'll put it right here for you. Um, they had two different sets actually for a corgi, but these are the two that I got for her. So in this one, the inside has a crown on each page. And on this one, it says, I believe in unicorns on the top of the page. And the last set I picked up, and of course, since I have a Frenchie, I picked up these right here, even though my Frenchie isn't this color, but still it's a French bulldog, I had to get it. And they have the Frenchie on each page. And then on this one, they have the little Frenchie there on the bottom. So those are the pads of paper that I picked up. Uh, I wasn't going to buy this because when I found it in the store, you know, I was just really excited to find it. And when I finally did, I'm like, yes. And I grabbed it and it's just like, it's, there's like hardly anything on here. It's the Shore Living line, which I think is absolutely adorable. Um, but if the Dollar Tree ever watches this or anyone that works for the Dollar Tree, I would really love to see a new line maybe for the fall of like woodsy items like for rustic woods, like camping or log cabin. I think that kind of stuff like, you know, a moose, bear. I think that'd be a really cool line. So, you know, just an idea. But anyway, I found the decorative jute rope. It's five feet long, but you guys, it is so thin. It's so lightweight. I, I think my fingernail weighs more than this. Um, I did get it because I'm just going to wrap it around one of my uh, tea light holders uh, and put it in the bathroom. But other than that, I don't know. I honestly don't think that is worth a dollar twenty-five. I think they could have made it at least eight to nine feet instead of five. Just my opinion. Just do so. They have a lot of cute fabric, which I call like a farmhouse fabric. And these are all by Crafter Square. They are 18 by 21 and they are a hundred percent cotton. I picked up two different ones 
and these are the ones that I chose. Um, you can make little throw pillows with these. You can use these in a background and maybe a picture frame or scrapbooking. You could glue these on boards or whatnot. So maybe that'll give you some ideas on how to use some of their fabric. Um, they have four different ones of these. I just picked up the one. These are by Cracker Square. It is a galvanized metal sign. And I went ahead and got the home one. They also had one that said love, welcome. And honestly, I can't remember what the other one is. You can always paint these if you want, if you just didn't like that plain Jane galvanized look. And I don't think, you know, well, I guess it does fit on there if you wanted to stick that on your house. Or you can just, you know, hang it elsewhere if you choose to. I did pick up the galvanized clam shell, whatever. And most likely I will put that in my kids' bathroom. Now I did think about, because I think you can bend these. If you got two of them, you could glue them and kind of have it almost opening, uh, you know, kind of open. And the Dollar Tree does carry these little bags of different shape or different sizes of like the pearls. That would be something cute to maybe um, be coming out of the clam. Just an idea. And then the other item that the galvanized theme, I guess. I got the seahorse one. They do have a couple of different ones, but I thought the seahorse was cute and I'm going to use some of the rub-ons and probably just put the Mowins on there and hang that downstairs. Now this item I thought was very interesting. It was at the checkout lane. I always still shop when I'm standing in the checkout lane and I'm like, hmm, that looks pretty cool. So I picked up one. I'm like, this is the real deal. This is a stethoscope by the pediatric you get one, of course, single patient, plastic, um, light blue. This is what the packaging looks like. And I tried it and this thing really works good. It's not the Fisher Price kind, you know, that we all screened in and we put these on your friend's ears or your sibling. And then you take the little sponge part and you scream in it real loud. And, you know, maybe it's just me, but this, I mean, it, I mean, it's so sensitive. I listened to my dog's belly after I fed him breakfast and I'm like, whoa, you got a lot of activity going on in there, girl. But yeah, look at that. Huh. So, I mean, I'm sure you can give this to a little one to play with. I don't know. I don't know if you would do that because I didn't want them to bust their hearing, but I don't, I mean, it's just amazing. I was like, oh, what? Okay, so let me show you on the items I have down here. Of course, they have a bunch of new canvas. Usually when I come across the new canvas by special moments, I always like to lay them out at the um, store and show you all the new ones that they have. But these two right here were my favorite ones. And again, these are by special moments. So these are the two that I decided to get. Now you can always take the canvas off of that and just use the wood frame for something else. And you can wrap this maybe around a vase of some sort and glue it on there. So, uh, I picked up these wall stickers. These do not ruin your walls. They do not chip the paint or anything like that. So this one, and I don't know if you guys know, but if you open these up and run your finger down, they open up like that, just an FYI. But yeah, you just can take that off just like that and you just stick it on your wall, you put it on your window, you can put it on a picture frame, you could put it on uh, a shelf. I don't know, you could put it on pretty much anything that you want. They are sticky, but they do not ruin your walls. I think the colors were absolutely beautiful. They would go in here perfect. Now, I know they had stuff like this earlier, and I know I bought them, but I couldn't remember if they had this one. So just in case, I did grab it. Um, I just really, really love these colors together. That's why you see a lot of my stuff that matches the decor, besides my funny signs that I love to include in my videos because I have an amazing personality and humor. Um, so you... For those that have been following me for a long time, you know that I have, uh, I have a, um, uh, I don't know, a, a funny bone, I guess. And I just, I just love to make you laugh. I'm just being me 
and I do silly things. I do dumb things. I do crazy things. And so, yeah. And I smell stuff too. I don't know why, but I always have to smell stuff. I don't, I don't know. It's just one of those things I was born with, I guess. Oh, and I forgot my last, no, it's not my last item, but I bought the seahorse. It says salty and happy. It does have the galvanized um, star on here. Make sure your seahorse has that because I did find a couple at the Dollar Tree that they did not have that on there. So just make sure you check over your decor before you put it in your cart or basket. I thought that was cute. Plain on that side. So if you'd want to do something else, you can do it on that side. And I just picked up one of these. They had three different ones, but this is the sand of my favorite beach. We take my kids to Michigan every single year. Um, different beaches here and there, but I just love going to Michigan and I always pick up a rock on the beach and I put the date on it and I put it outside, but I might just grab some sand and the next time we go to Florida, or whatever, but I will not go on any kind of long distant vacations when I still have Ruby because that's my dog that has cancer in that and I will not leave her. So if anything, we just go to Michigan for the day. So I will put my memories in here of sand. Yeah. Should pick up a couple of those and give them my daughters and I didn't even think about it. Um, they had this in men's and women's. This is uh, the Gel Arch. This is the men's size 7 to 13. It's try it risk free, made in the USA. If you have any issues with your arch or pain, um, I figured for $1.25, I would go ahead and try this for my husband. Again, they did have men's and women's, and that is where you're going to see what one it's for. Um, this is what they look like, the arch. They are kind of foamy, like silicone-y, silicone -y. I think I just created a new word, silicone -y. And just in Jenny's world, I tell you. Okay, I bought these because number one, they had three of them. Number two, they are small and I'm gonna put these on my dogs. I have three dogs and these little hats are gonna be so cute. I'm sure these are for what, Cinco de Mayo or something, I'm not sure. But oh my gosh, I am totally putting these on my dogs and I'll try to get some footage of it. But they are plastic. How cute. And these would be even really cute to put on like uh, American Girls or My Generation dolls or something. So you can use them for dress up for your dolls. Uh, this is the Salon uh, Professional Freezing Hairspray Makeup Hold on Scented. It's a uh, five. They always rate it on how strong it is. It is a uh, freeze control. It's a 10 ounce. It says, did it say? on scented. Now I use, I think it's a Carrie, not Carrie. Huh, I can't even think of the name brand that I use in my hairspray. Kenra? I don't know. I'll put it right here. But anyway, that's the hairspray I use. It doesn't have scent. Wow. Wait, no, no scent. So yeah, $1.25, I thought that was a good deal. Just give it to my daughter since she goes through stuff like that, like it's from water. And the last items in the shoreline I picked up were these anchors. They have three different colors. They have it in blue, red, and white. You can keep them these colors or you can spray paint them if you choose to. You can glue these onto different things if you wanted to do your own DIY. You can take like some of the Dollar Tree long boards that they have, and I don't have anything close by, but you know the long boards, and you can hang these on there if you want. You can write names on there, but I think they're good quality actually, you know, and I like how they have it in multiple colors. And these are actually, you know, colors for, you know, 4th of July and everything. So, yeah. A few other items I will share with you. And these are the three foldable fans, foldable fans. Um, they are 8.25 inch by nine and a half. So I'm gonna go ahead and open and I will show you what all three look like. They are plastic and paper, so not anything heavy duty and fancy, but this will come in handy if you're in a facility that is steaming hot or even on an airplane 
last time I flew, it was like a trillion degrees in there. And I thought I was going to hyperventilate because I was so hot. So I picked those up. And some other non-exciting items, but I think these containers are absolutely adorable. They have five different ones, and these are the wafers. Well, look how cute these jars are. I'm going to go ahead and line them up here and show you all the different ones they have. Um, you can always spray paint these if you didn't like the pictures and do other things with them, like put ponytail holders in them or clips of some sort, makeup brushes or whatever. But I think the tins are absolutely adorable. So I bought one each. And of course you get the food inside, which I don't think I've ever had their wafers before. And I don't know if I can get one of these undone in a timely manner. Oh, wait, I think I did. Wow, that's the first. And this is what the package Ooh, they smell good. Oh, I know I can't eat it because I'm having a flare now. I can eat anything. Ooh. Oh. Look at these. Ew. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's good. No, Jenny, don't. You're going to get a flare up. Wow, oh, that's good. Kind of reminds me of those wafers cookies. You can get it either in vanilla, chocolate, or strawberry. Oh, wow. Those are so good. <laughs> I want to eat them. Anyway. And the other food item I picked up, we had a couple of different flavors, but this is the Quaker Instant Oat Cocoa Sea Salt. You get six bags of oatmeal. I only eat the brown sugar oatmeal, but my husband likes all these weird flavors on that. But So I picked that up for him. Not bad for $1.25. And the last item I picked up are these 500 silent little rubber bands. I compared them to the other generic ones that the Dollar Tree carries that pretty much if you stretch them a little too far, they like explode and they break and they're, they're like actually, you know, completely pointless. But these are a little bit thicker, so I'm hoping these work. My daughter uses these for her hair, so we shall see. So that is everything that I bought at my Dollar Tree, so I hope I was able to show you something that maybe you can go find at one of your local stores. If you enjoyed this video, I would love for you to hit that like button. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I would really love to have you. Also, I wanted to do a um, Q&A at some point. So if you have a question that you would like um, to have me answer, go ahead and comment down below and I'll be taking screenshots of some of your questions. And at a later date, I will do an entire video of Q&As and answer some of your questions. So with all that said, I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful, safe day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Keep smiling. Bye. 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 Bye.